Good morning, River Valley. Um, hey, we are um, on workout number two this week. It's called Partner Relay Workout. Hopefully you can see the screen okay. It's basically, um, I just did it with my Zoom class and my neighbor. It took us about 22 minutes. We did three rounds. What it involves is five exercises you can see below here. And I would do that exercise continuously as long as it took my partner to run 25 meters, which is the length of my driveway. At the end of the driveway, she does 25 uh, jumping jacks, 25 jumping jacks, and she sprints back and distantly, when she gets to the cement here, tells me it's my turn to go. Then she does that exercise I was just doing, and I do the sprint 25 jumping jacks and back. So we do that each for every exercise. There's Sage, good morning Sage. And um, we go all the way through the five exercises and we do that for three rounds. It's a lot of fun. Man, we got a sweat going as you'll see in a minute when I zoom out here. And um, I'm gonna take a minute right now and I'm gonna show you what these five exercises are. Morning guys. Okay, exercise one is called windshield wiper push-ups. You can do it, um, Pull my mat back just a little bit. You can do it off your thighs or off your toes, but basically you do a push-up, travel, couple to your right, push-up, travel back to the middle, another push-up, and then go to your left. And what it looks like is you're making windshield wipers. So push-up, 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 push-up. We keep doing that until Denise runs down at the end of the lane. Does her 25 jumping jacks, comes back, she gets to the cement, she says switch. Now I run. When I get back, we go to exercise two. Continuous in-out inchworm, and you start in a plank, and you start by my feet, go up, try not to bend my knees, this is all core. Arms go up and down. We never move our arms and feet at the same time. We got that? And then my partner and I switch, and I'd be running. The third exercise is tricep dips. You'll need a chair for this. I'm going to use my garden bench here. I want to keep my back really close to the bench. My fingers forward, and I'm going to go down and up, keeping my back close to the bench so I'm not hurting my shoulders. I can also make it harder and bring my feet out if I'd like a little bit better tricep work. Then I switch with my partner. Try um, exercise four, you can use a kettlebell or a, a dumbbell. Pretend your arms are completely out of it. Arms are paralyzed, no use. I'm gonna show you sideways. I'm gonna squat and bring it above my head. So what, what brings the kettlebell up is my hip drive. What stops it at the top is I'm flexing my stomach to stop at the top. I don't want it to go behind my ears. I'm looking forward so I don't bend over at the waist when I get to here. I want to keep a strong core. Exercise five, the last one of the round. I'm gonna use my mat, hands under my shoulders, and I am gonna do jacks. If that gets too hard while you're waiting for your partner, you can go to a single leg. That, my friends, is one round that should take you about seven minutes. It took us 22 minutes to do three rounds this morning. It rocked. It's a great Wednesday morning here in central Wisconsin. Um, hope you guys have as great of a workout as we did, and I hope you guys are staying well. Peace.